everyone, I'm Dinosaur Boy and today I'm going to tell you guys some facts about Orfish. Because a YouTuber called Anon Works requested me to say some facts about this magnificent creature Orfish. Orfish are large, greatly elongated, pelagic, lempiform fish belonging to the small family Regulicidae, found in all temperate to tropical oceans, yet rarely seen, the oarfish family contains three species in two genera. One of these is the giant oarfish, scientific name Regulacus glensnae, is the longest bony fish alive today. It grew up to 8 meters or 26 feet in length. The common name oarfish is thought to be in orientation either to their highly compressed and elongated bodies or to the now humiliated belief that the fish row themselves through the water with their pelvic fins. The family name Regulicidae is derived from the Latin regulus, meaning royal. The rare beachings of all fish after storms and their habit of remaining at the surface when sick or dying make all fish a likely source of many sea serpent tails. Although the larger species are considered game fish and are fished commercially to a slight range, but all fish are rarely caught alive. Their flesh is not well considered for eating due to its gelatinous consistency. If we go to its anatomy and morphology, the dorsal fin originates from above the relatively large eyes and runs the entire length of the fish. Of the approximately 400 dorsal fin rays, the first 10 to 13 are elongated to changeable degrees, forming a trailing crest inflated with reddish spots and flaps of skin at the ray tips. The pelvic fins are equally elongated and decorated, reduced to one of the five rays each. The pectoral fins are greatly reduced and positioned low on the body. The anal fin is completely absent and the caudal fin may be reduced or absent as well with the body pointed to a fine point. All fins lack true spines. At least one excuse from researchers in New Zealand described the oarfish as giving off electric shocks when touched. Like other members of its order, the oarfish has a small yet extremely protrusible leaning mouth with no visible teeth. The body is scaleless and the skin is covered with easily abraded silvery gunine. In the stream of fish, scientific name Agrostictes parkeri, the skin is clad with hard tubercles. All species lack gas bladders and the number of gill rakers is flexible. All fish coloration is also flexible. The flanks are normally covered with irregular bluish and blackish streaks black dots and squiggles. These markings quickly fade following death. It's probably that these markings are bioluminescent in the deep sea. The giant oarfish is by far the largest member of the family at a published total length of 8 meters or 26 feet with unconfirmed news of 11 meters or 36 feet and 7 meters or 56 feet specimens and 270 kilograms in weight. The streamer fish is known to reach 3 meters 
or 10 feet in length, while the largest recorded specimen of Regalecus raselli measured 5.4 meters or 18 feet. Oarfish have the longest known length of any living species of bony fish. If we now go to its range, the oarfish is thought to inhabit the epipelagic to mesopelagic ocean layers, ranging from 200 meters or 660 feet to 1000 meters or 3300 feet and is rarely seen on the surface. A few have been found still barely alive, but usually if one floats to the surface, it dies. At the depths of all fish live a few or no currents. As a result, they build little muscle mass and they cannot survive in shallower turbulent water. And then now we go to its distribution. The members of the family are known to have a worldwide range. However, human encounters with live oarfish are rare and spreading information is collected from records of oarfish caught or washed ashore. Okay everyone, that's the end of part one. In part two, I'll be mentioning in part two, I'll be mentioning some other interesting facts about oarfish. So now this is the end of part one. I hope you guys liked and enjoyed this. If you did, please don't forget to subscribe and like. And until next time, I'll see you guys later. Bye.